know where is P. Diddy? After the feds raided three of his homes for Epstein-like crimes and he was nowhere to be found, people are wondering if he is on the run. Savage! I'm a savage! Oh! I'm a savage! Whatever I want, I'm going to get! Whatever I want, I have to get! It really appears as though Diddy's freedom is coming to an end after the feds raided his many houses last night, and he has allegedly attempted to flee the country on his private jet because of it. Are we really about to witness the man's empire crumble in front of our very own eyes? Be sure to stick around till the end for the full details. In a matter of weeks, the hip-hop mogul's houses in Los Angeles and Miami were raided following allegations of trafficking and sexual assault. Others who were following his private plane said it touched down on the island of Antigua in the Caribbean after Diddy was questioned by customs officers on Monday night at Miami airport. That's right, Diddy has fled the motherfucking scene. <laughs> Multiple media sources have said that Diddy has left the fucking country. And he left as he knew this shit was going down. So according to the Jasmine brand, Diddy's jet took off at Van Nuys airport earlier today. So he knew this shit was coming. And it landed in the airfield of Barbuda. I don't even know where the fuck that's at. Well, according to TMZ, his little private jet, that nice, beautiful black Gulfstream 5 has landed in Antigua, which is down in the Caribbean. Is that a no extradite? I'm just asking for a friend. Honestly, how you gonna leave your sons? You left your sons. Did you leave your daughters too? Because that shit is foul, my boy. If I was your sons, I'd be right. Make sure you subscribe to the channel and turn on the post notification bell. This way you'll never miss out on any future celebrity videos similar to these. The fact Diddy himself wasn't present when the raids were going on made it ever so clear. He knew it was imminent, but why leave his family there to experience it happen? The fact he let his children take the fall is very telling. People are calling him Flea Diddy. He knew ahead of time this was going down. As you would all know by now, 50 Cent has been on Diddy's neck for a while now and didn't hesitate whatsoever when it came out bringing up the situation with houses being raided where he captioned the post. Now it's not Diddy do it, it's Diddy done. They don't come like that unless they got a case. Like we have mentioned before in videos, if 50 Cent has a problem with someone and is relentless as this, he knows something we don't as he's behind the scenes so knows firsthand how dodgy Diddy can be and has even mentioned it openly in the past. <laughs> I'm telling you, that's like, yeah. I'm telling you, look, look. Later you gonna find out a little shit that oh, I be saying. Man. Man. <laughs> you understand what I'm saying? Too. Man, listen, I'm trying to tell you the truth. But yep. the truth, sometimes it hurts. Right. It hurts people and they don't want to hear that shit, but uh, I'm trying to tell you. And I Ask me, could he take me shopping? And it fucked me up because I'm looking like, what you <laughs> A similar situation which backs up 50's point is when Takashi 69 got raided in September 2018. Then just a few months later in November, he was sentenced to life in prison, but of course infamously snitched his way out, which makes it seem that it's highly likely a similar instance will happen with Diddy, as the fact his houses were raided shows they have some big dirt on him already. Homeland Security come get you, not the FBI, not the DEA, not the ATF, but Homeland is a whole department that controls all those independent agencies. You have a serious problem. This is gonna be more than a RICO case. I ain't never seen Homeland Security chase nobody that wasn't associated with Bin Laden. He had to do some serious ish to have super feds chasing him. This is gonna be bigger than a RICO. It's about time. I'm glad Cassie stood up. She opened the door for justice for so many others. Well done. Speaking of... <laughs>